Hey folks, got another ramen review today. This was surprising. This is new from Marchan. Mar um, I know it's pretty popular, but I never eat this or top ramen. I, I always find others that are better, but this one really surprised me. And I found it of all places, 7-Eleven. I've been grocery shopping at a couple of different stores and I have not seen this particular wonton ramen soup. That's a picture of what I'm hoping this looks like. So we shall see. 7-Eleven. Now this is, I wanted to look at the sodium. So for this whole thing, 89% USDA, so it's like uh, a little over two, two grams. Let's see what it looks like and uh, hopefully it's good. Oh, they only had two flavors and they were both chicken. They had the, this, which was the regular and the other one was a hot and spicy. So I just picked this one up. They didn't have beef or anything else. So I don't know if those are available, but I'll keep an eye out. So like all ramen, you pull back halfway and there's a uh, dried veggie pack and then there's the flavor flavor packet it's odd because the uh, the instructions say to add this to the ramen and then add the water and then later after like three three and a half four minutes add the flavor packet and uh most ramen is, it's opposite. I, and I always put this in first, so I'm just going to go ahead and put this in first with the veggies. But I was really curious to see what these, uh, what these wontons, they're, they're, those are the wontons. I was curious to see what they look like. What are they stuffed with? Uh, it looks like... Looks like there's one, two, three, four, maybe five wontons, at least five wontons on top. So we shall see. Okay, flavor packet. Well, that's heavy on the, uh, the celery salt. the veggies and add to the fill line you know I'm always curious about these larger bowls of ramen that look like about two about two cups okay I'm going to let this go for, I'm going to let this go for four minutes and I'll be back and we'll see what it tastes like. It's been four minutes. Let's see how we did. Those uh, wontons rehydrated quite well. Give us a good toss. Oh, there's a lot of, a lot of food here, a lot of noodles. Okay, since this is a wonton noodle, let's, let's give this, try to fish a wonton out of here. That's one of the wontons. I gotta say, I like that wonton. That's a really good flavor. It's something different. It's something, you know, you don't see all the time. It looks like there's cabbage. There's some corn. Okay, I'm going to give this broth. Oh, and carrots. I'm going to give this broth a sip. Good flavor on that broth. I like that. Okay. See if I can get a bite of pretty much everything here. 
some noodles and some wontons. There we go. Mm. I gotta have another bite here. Got a bunch of cabbage here with some noodles. I gotta say, I really like this. I am really impressed. Marochan wonton ramen noodle soup. The flavor is really good. And I really like those wontons. And these noodles are really nice. I really like the, the texture and the flavor of those noodles. And the broth is really good. I will definitely uh, pick up some more of these. I hope I can get them in the, the grocery store. These were a little bit more expensive at uh, at the 7-Eleven. I think they were like $3 and something. You know, normally in a in the grocery store, this might be like $1.79. And one more last thing. I remembered to bring home the uh, the salsa matcha from, from work because we didn't eat it all. And I've been wanting to add this to ramen because I think it would be good, a good chili oil to add to ramen. So here I go. I'm going to give this a try. A little bit more chili oil. Kind of kick it up a little bit. Okay, that works. That's really good. I'll be doing that from now on. Well, there you have it, folks. Definitely a thumbs up. Thanks for watching.